Welcome back guys, back at the cabin. As you can see, we got the pontoon in, it's ready to go. Had to change the starter on it. Um, purchased the starter last year and that thing was a piece of junk. So I put the old starter back in because it was a solenoid that went out. Anyway, I spared you guys all the swearing because I had to change it on the dock right here. And I'm gonna go grill some burgers and enjoy a quiet weekend at the cabin. light's so old, Graham. Well, I know. You told me that oh. this light used to be at an operating table or something. Yeah, it, it was a... An oh, we over... hung over many dead people. Yeah. No, it's an overhead light for like a bathroom in a nursing home. Sure. And uh, Vern and I were working in the same nursing home. Back in. Yeah, I figured you could just make them up and then shut it down. Come in for five, ten minutes, come back, flip them or something. That's great. Great. Look at the mice been in there. Look at the oh, yeah. insulation. Jesus Christ. You're living in there. That's why that guy came out. Yeah. Living in the stove. Living in the, the ash. Mice get in there. 
Jesus Christ. That's what that, it's all insulation in there. It's not ash. Wow. Yeah, whatever insulation Little Lee can find, I guess. Must be up in the attic. I don't really know if the walls were ever insulated here. No. I know they put insulation in the attic. That used to be the thinking, and it still is. If you insulate the attic, you can keep a lot of heat in there. Oh, look at all the trash. If I could go back, I'd tell my parents and grandparents that this is not the way to go. Oh well, I think it's a project for the kids. Put on some gloves. And clean up the trash around here, because what I'd like to do is put a dock out here in our bay and then have a gradual step up and then back the cabins right over here so i got some cleaning to do as i walk down and around the property this this is what's left of the old wooden boat yeah when i was a kid there was still more to it you could kind of see the sides but now she's pretty much Falling apart here, become part of the earth. Yep, yeah. used to have wooden boats out here. Well, now that we're up here and the rain stopped a little bit, I'm gonna move some of this wood. I gotta move those piles, eventually take these big red pines down here and behind the cabin there. And then these ones over over there and mill them up for the, the new build but right now we're gonna move this stuff
right up here. Well, I got that stacked, moved it out. Go take one more wrap around. Huh, buddy? What do you think, Ryder? Huh? What do you think? Oh, good puppers. <clears throat> well, we got all that put away. And I'm just trying to plan everything out here. So I think when I take the cabin down, kind of work out here, eventually I'm gonna have solar. So the north is this way and my cabin, unfortunately the ridge is a uh, is, uh, north facing slope. So um, I think we still get pretty good solar though if I clear all these trees out, but that's the plan when we build the cabin then I'm going to set up solar right right in this area here and uh, have a little solar shack and set her up. Yeah, up here, there won't be any plumbing. Um, I'll wire the cabin and everything, but that's it. So I'll go show you guys a little bit in the little cabin what I got to do next. So inside, uh, the next plan is I'm just going to start ripping sheeting down, um, take all this out of here, all the bedding, everything, um, you know, stove, all of this, kitchen, dinette, whatever area, and then uh, just start taking, taking the sheeting off, and then there's some insulation behind here, take all that down, rip everything out, um, salvage what I can, and then, uh, once all that's out, then I'm now I'm gonna rip the roof off and take the floor out, salvage everything, and then we'll be ready to do the foundation. So I'm gonna start doing that next trip. Hider, what do you think? What do you think, bud? Next trip? Clean her up? Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Eider's ready to go. So another short trip to the cabin. Dad and I are getting packed up. And biggest thing is wanted to get the pontoon in. Next time I come up, the kids will be here. So wanted to make sure everything was set up for them. It'll be opening of fishing. That's the hope anyway, barring anything with work. So two weeks till the opening of fishing. We should be up again. Go, Dad. Well, we're all loaded up. My dad's taking off. Eider and I are on the pontoon. We are going to hit the road. Bye, cabin. See you on opener.